Central Missouri Jennies basketball is back inside the multi-purpose building hosting Pittsburgh State. The seventh-ranked Jennies enter the night on top of the MIAA with a 13-1 conference record, 17-1 overall. First quarter, Warren Frost jabs step, drives and pulls up from the charity stripe. Jens trailing by three. Three minutes left in the quarter, Sierra Smith to Brooke Literal inside, pump fake and finishes off the glass, gets the Jennies within one. One minute to go off the pick and roll. Frost drops a dime to Grayson Holden and lays it in. Central Missouri down 18 to 16 after the first. Second quarter, Kate Hackerot with the board gets trapped underneath. Dishes to Olivia Nelson cutting the lane for two. UCM down 26 to 23. Six minutes until the break, Nelson driving baseline finds Frost in the corner and connects for three. Jens still down by two. Right before the break, Nelson dumps it down low to Littrell and she scores. Littrell had 13 in the first half. The Jennies head into the locker room tied with Pitt State at 36. Opening moments of the third quarter, Nelson feeds Ashley Tull on the right block. Backs down on Grace Pyle, turns and puts it up off the window. That would be the Jens' first lead of the contest, up 38 to 36. A few plays later, Literal kicks it out to Nelson at the top of the key, sinks the triple, ties it at 41. Still in the third, Frost on the break. She fakes right and goes left for the finish. UCM back on top, 45 to 44. Warren Frost had 11 points and five assists. UCM would lead it 56 to 52 after three complete. The Jennies putting it away in the fourth. Nelson spins and scores with her left. Olivia Nelson finished with 21 points and five rebounds. Then Nelson gives to Literal in the paint. She goes to work, turns and gets the tough shot to go. Brooke Literal led UCM with 24 points and eight boards. Late in the game, Frost throws a no-look pass to Tull underneath for the easy bucket. Ashley Tull had 12 points and five rebounds. The Jennies take down Pitt State by the final 80 to 68. Central Missouri improves to 18 and one overall, 14 and one in the MIAA. We've had rough starts before and we knew if we get flustered, like things are gonna turn out bad for us. So we had to stay strong mentally. We knew we had to be tougher and we came out second half and we were a lot tougher and I think everybody could tell. And I think we were a completely different team the second half. The bench came out, gave a ton of energy. Um, the support from the crowd was amazing. It was just a good game. Wins don't come easy in February and finding ways to win on the defensive floor or offensively is just how you keep pushing yourself and get to March and make a big run. Next two weeks are probably the two biggest weeks of our season. I'm excited. I uh, just want to get back out there and play because it's going to be another tough game and seeing like the whole football team and all the community members and parents is just really special to us and we love it.